set in the starter, lets them go in. Jelly Bean will lead by 10 metres on Freaky Feet Bandit. They'll have a good battle as they come into the straight. They're about 25 metres clear on Devil Dodger from Sweet Chili Willy. Yankee Paco is on its outside. Well back to Sir Dudley and Firestorm and the Grey Ollie on fire on the outside. They're well clear of Fireblaze. Nidia's got past the couple, including Ash's Boy and Stella Frost. 300 metres left to run and in front it's Jelly Bean and Travis Martin. But its main danger is it to its outside now and that is Freaky Feet, Bandit and Abby Sanderson. They're still well clear on Sweet Chili Willy, Devil Dodger and Yankee Paco. Then you got Sir Dudley making up a little bit of ground from Ollie on fire. Nidia to the outside, headed off Fireblaze. Then would have been Firestorm back on the inside from Ash's Boy. And last of all is Stella Frost. 200 to go. And up on the outside, Freaky Feet Bandit hits the leader, puts the head in front. But Devil Dodger and Yankee Paco, the chestnut's the widest runner. It's coming out after him strongly and puts the head in front for Jayla Beresford and starts to pull away. It's Yankee Paco, but to its inside, Devil Dodger's going with it. They're having a good battle inside the 100. It's Yankee Paco, a narrow leader on Devil Dodger from Freaky Feet Bandit Jellybean. There's no Nidia for the moment from Sir Dudley, but it passed the 50. And Yankee Paco trotting faultlessly down to the line will open up with a 10 meter advantage on Devil Dodger. And Yankee Paco takes out the second. Devil Dodger just wanted to gallop across the line in second. Now for third, you got Nidia flashing at Freaky Feet Bandit, but missed. Sir Dudley. Then you got Jellybean. Well back was Sweet Chili Willy from Ollie on Fire. Fireblaze was getting through the pack. And then you got Ashes Boy with Firestorm and Stella Frost. But the second to Yankee Paco and Jayla Beresford beating Devil Dodger and Freaky Feet Bandit for third.